Hello everyone, this is Qian. I'm currently a professor in material science engineering of University of Illinois Urbana Champaign. My group works on nanoscience of soft materials. What I'm going to talk with you today is a new effort in my group that is to utilize the surface science to do beautiful patterns on curved nanoparticles. So for now, I'll relate to my students, Aryang and Chanson to show you how this strategy works. This idea of atomic stenciling actually came from a pottery class I took during my second year of grad school. We learned the technique called stenciling, which involves a waxing mask on ceramics to create patterns, even something as intricate as Mona Lisa. Then I wondered, can we do stencil on the nanoparticles? Now, let's imagine this ceramic piece is a gold nanoparticle. First, I apply wax to specific regions we want to mask. Similarly, on nanoparticles, we use iodide to selectively mask certain facets based on their thermodynamic surface energies. Next, I brush the piece with black ink. This represents coating the nanoparticles with ligands and polymers. Thanks to the mask, the ink only sticks to unmasked regions. And that's exactly how we decorate polymers with nanoscale precision on the curved surfaces of nanoparticles. Unlike macro-scale stenciling, the beauty of our atomic stencil method is that it allows us to pattern billions of nanoparticles in solutions simultaneously, each decorated with precise molecular patterns, and everything all in a single afternoon. So for a really long time, people have already known that different ions can selectively absorb onto different facets of nanoparticles. So what we're able to show is how to use this rather old knowledge to create a new class of materials synthetically in close collaboration with our simulation collaborator, Professor Sharon Glosso at University of Michigan, and our theoretical collaborator, Professor Kristen Fithron at Penn State, doing beautiful density functional theory calculation for this system.